What up everybody, David here. Andrew here. And welcome to our very first episode of Comments, comments on comments. comments. This is the show where we comment on your comments. Today we're gonna be commenting on a very popular video series about the things that Asian guys and Asian girls like and hate. Let's, Let's go. go. Things Asian girls like. Comment from Rewex. Small cute things. Seriously, no one has made a penis joke yet? Cute small things penis analogy was probably the most popular comment that we got on that video from guys. Oh, we try to make fun of Asian guys. We knew it was coming, we just don't care. Mary Walker said, I hate you guys, you are the worst. That's too bad, Mary, because you're the best. Ruby Wynn said, Asian middle school girls also approved. Thanks, Thanks Ruby. Ruby. Moving on to things Asian guys like. Things Asian guys like. Matt Levesque says, open your eyes. Megan Donahue, wait. Win is pronounced win. Did I hear that right? Because if so, I called my old boss the wrong last name. Oh, maybe that's why he gave me the you are such a white girl look. It's all good. Actually, this is a comment that we got a lot, surprisingly, that a lot of people were like, oh my gosh, that's actually how you pronounce win. Other popular ways to mangle that name are Nguyen, Nguyen, or a Nguyen. Zmaster180 says, what about anime? Ah, good point. We actually included anime in the things that nerdy Asian guys like video. Jack Tang says, haha, these guys just read me like a book, a children's novel. <laughs> what a <laughs> poetic way to indicate this fit me. Jack Tang, we read you like a book, man. Things Asian girls hate. You ready? Let's do this. Christy Nakashima said, so I'm not Asian because I like hardcore music, and then she made this face. No, oh. you're still Asian. That was a popular comment that we got. A lot of Asian girls said that they do like hardcore music. I could see a lot of Asian girls who particularly spend a large portion of time on the internet liking hardcore music. If a lot of those girls watch our videos, thank you, and thumbs up to hardcore music. David, you said, there is way too much energy in this video. <laughs> I didn't know we could get that comment on YouTube that there's actually uh, too much energy. Come on, David, what are you doing all day? Things, Things Asian, Asian guys, guys hate. hate. Mini cupcakes, baby. You guys are hot, just so you know. Thank, Thank you. you. Blue Monkey 800 basically made a really long comment that said, as a black woman, she understands what Asian guys go through because black men are very desirable in American society and Asian women are viewed very desirable in Asian society. So she knows what it's like to be the unwanted part of her ethnicity. Black girls, we feel your pain. That's real. Shannon C says, funny how on the internet we find a bunch of non-Asian girls that love Asian guys, but when it comes to real life, Asian guys don't seem to find them and non-Asian girls tend to not find Asian guys attractive. Lol, life sucks, huh? Basically, you guys, not every person in the world knows every other single person in the world. In fact, most people operate in a circle of about 25 people. That's incredibly small compared to the world population of what? Seven billion. So if you really think about it, just because there is a person in a far off country that likes Asian guys, and you're an Asian guy who wants to meet a non-Asian girl, the chances of you guys connecting and being in each other's 25 closest circle of people is pretty small, unfortunately. Maybe a way you can connect is through our YouTube. Uh, you know, if you guys want to use our comments section for like dating each other, I don't care. Jennifer L says, dang, you didn't put Ryan Higa as one of the Asian people. My bad, Ryan. We left you out, man. We forgot you. We meant to put you in. Terry Sky says, yeah, Asian guys are God's experiment gone wrong. The only remedy is the Fung Brothers score Miley Cyrus and Selena Gomez. <laughs> I hope that is not the only remedy for this because it's probably not gonna happen. Let us say that that would affect culture though. Sharita Hasia, I find David really attractive. See, look at that. Sharita. Put a smile on that's, her face. That's for you. Lotha Rever, that Confucius part was really eye-opening OMFG. Yes, it was. Sabrina Brox, I loved Asian guys before K-pop, but I'm not gonna lie, K-pop did just fuel my fire a little bit more. Yes, I think for non-Asian girls who already were into Asian guys, K-pop is like a wet dream for them. So a lot of people ask, why do we make these lists? We are trying to spark discussion. Asian Americans, or as a group, we have not really defined ourselves in this country. And not that our definition is the end all be all. If you don't fit this, if your Asian girl likes hardcore music, you're not Asian anymore. No, you're, still Asian. you're still Asian. We're just trying to point out some common patterns that we saw. 
Yeah, and we might be only talking about a certain type of Asian girl, and that's gonna get you thinking like, oh, there is a type of Asian girl that's into all these things or that hates all these things. We're just here to get people to think about themselves. And all those comments, we appreciate all of them, even the negative ones, the positive ones, the so-so ones. We appreciate the fact that you are thinking about our video and the words that we're saying. All right, everybody, that was our first episode of Comments, comments on, on Comments. comments where we comment on your comments. So keep commenting and then we will comment on your comments. Peace. Peace. All right guys, thank you for watching that video of comments on comments. I'm laying on a couch now, but check out this video, check out this video, check out this shirt, acupuncture.com. You know, my name is Andrew, that was my brother David. We like to make a lot of videos about a lot of things. So subscribe to our channel. Peace.